All right. I have waited two and a half years for this game, and it's finally out. Gotham freaking Knights, dude. Like, man, I thought this game would never come out, bro. It's been two and a half freaking years. WB Games Montreal. Man. So this is going to be episode one of this. So. Yeah. Alright. So. Let's cut to the intro. And this is a warning before we start. So make sure to read this. Alright, you've read it. Let's get started. <laughs> I'm not sure if this is going to have like the same controls as the Arkham games, but I'll put it on medium. Because I, I, I assume it's going to be similar and the brightness has to be a little bit higher than usual for video. No, it should be lower for video. Contrast should be a little higher for video and saturation should be a little bit lower. You're not really going to notice anything really different. Okay, so. Oh, that's kind of a cool opening. Oh, this is him telling you he's dead. If you're watching this, I'm dead. Oh my god. Shocker. <laughs> Bro, the Batmo Batmobile looks kind of dope, bro. Oh. Who shot arrow at Batman? Who shoot arrow at Batman? No, Batman, get up. Alright, who shot that at him? Sumo. Don't take it out! Don't take it out! Dude, don't take it out, you're gonna die of blood loss, idiot. <laughs> okay, okay. I wanna say this before, I have completely stayed off of YouTube when it comes to this game. So if I have no idea what the hell I'm talking about, it's because I have not watched anything about this game except for like the official trailers released by WB Games Montreal and even then I haven't watched much of that corruption still flourishes in Gotham lurking in every shadow you don't need that man he kind of gives me uh Ra's al Ghul vibes yep up okay I freaking predicted it you think you could keep it from me Okay, Batman and Ra's al Ghul in a fight. Ra's al Ghul's actor is pretty good. Okay. Intruder alert. Oh, he has like the Riddler uh, question mark. In his in the back cave, and he has a Joker card that a reference to the Arkham games and uh, Riddler's Revenge, the Mark of Knight. Probably not, but okay. So he's contacting Red Hood, Batgirl, Robin, and Nightwing. All right, he dodged these. He's dodging these until he doesn't. No one's coming to help you. I'll deal with you myself. Dude, this intro is so epic. Alright, he shuts a weapon at the thing. Alright. Batman's climbing up. 
I don't think he's gonna make it. This is intense. All right, the Batwing, the thing that never got used in any of the Arkham games for some reason. I also pre-ordered the deluxe edition of this game, so I also believe I will get some extra content. All right. Dude, this fight is so freaking intense. All right. Batman swinging around, kicking Rache in the face. All right. Dude. What a great way to start the game, man. Like, what a great way to start the game. Okay. He can't die. He can't die by hitting the ground. Cause I want to know like how he's gonna make that recording. Okay. <laughs> All right. They're in like. Oh, kind of giving me some Arkham City and uh, Season of Infamy vibes because of the green mist surrounding him. I haven't played that much of Season of Infamy, so I wouldn't really know. So I can't really say much about that. All right, dude, this is the freaking coolest Batman video game battle ever. I'm... Oh. Should I just shut up and let this happen? Oh, okay. That had me at the edge of my seat. Oh, dude. Did he lose his entire hand? Oh, no, never mind. He's cut up, man. Gotham is their city now. This is such a freaking long intro. I want to play the game. Oh, poor bat. Okay, so this is like our start to the game. If 
you're watching this, I'm dead. This is a code black. This message was automatically triggered when I destroyed the cave and everything it contained. I know what's coming won't be easy. Batman's actually dead. Oh, I thought they were gonna bring him back somehow. I'm sure they are. <laughs> Dude, Nightwing looks really good. Like, I know you have to. Batgirl's model I'm looks sorry, really good. Uh, I enjoy Red Hood's costume quite a lot. The number one person that I'm looking forward to play as in this game is Red Hood. The other characters look like they flow much better. I just like Red Hood best. We both know it won't take long for Gotham's criminals to realize that Batman is gone. You can't count on the GCPD. Haven't trusted us since Jim died. You are clear to engage. Okay, so Jim Gordon is dead in this universe. I'm leaving you the Belfry as base of operations. Some of the technology is outdated, but it has the gear you need and all of my files. There. And he was that. But he was more than a headline. He was my nephew. He was a friend, a mentor, and a benefactor to those of us gathered here today. And to those of you who didn't know him as we did, I want to tell you this. Bruce was Gotham. He loved this city more than he loved anything. He was a protector to this city. He worked tirelessly behind the scenes to bring justice and equality. This is a pretty good opening, man. Took up like a bunch of my video, but... <laughs> I know you'll keep Gotham safe. Good luck. And goodbye. Okay. We gotta keep Gotham safe. I am not the person to trust this with at all. Alright. Ah, damn it. More cutscene. So, uh... There's gonna be a lot more cutscenes, so uh, how about we just skim through all that, don't we? Took him three years to agree to a vacation, and Bruce turned up dead. He asked for some time. He knows none of us were there either, right? What about you? You let Jacob Kane give the eulogy. He offered. He thought it'd be easier on us if he was the one to do it. He's Bruce's uncle. Hell of a speech. All that talk about a protector who works behind the scenes. If he only knew. Catherine wouldn't be there if she suspected. I can't see the anti-vigilante police commissioner presiding at Batman's funeral. There's something else she doesn't know. She has the body of Batman's killer in her morgue. Rachel Ghoul is listed as a John Doe, slated for cremation. And what if the League of Shadows finds him? If they drop their dear leader in a Lazarus pit, he won't be so dead anymore. You want to break into the GCPD headquarters for a what if? Be my guest. I decrypted the case Batman sent with his message. Can I just pick somebody? We should and then it's done? That. I looked it done. But did I get everything? 
It doesn't look complete. Just I shut up. I could not care less. All right. He's a gifted acrobat, rapid combos, it's good for our purposes, and a stick expert. <laughs> Stealth specialist, good for our predator purposes, tactical genius, also good, and bow staff prodigy. Brute strength, powerhouse brawler, master marksman, that's great for us, expert hacker, tough as nails, and single target, bruiser. Bruiser. All right, Red Hood. I'm done. All right, Red Hood. Oh, okay. We can actually play the game now. What a hell of an intro, dude. Like, that was so freaking long. <laughs> All right. I don't Back care. Of you. So this professor was Batman's last case? Kirk Langstrom. The half-finished file was attached to Batman's code black. There's something big there. Hopefully that means a fight. Could stand to let out some aggression right now. Emo? That's kind of cool. It has similar controls to the Arkham series, but they're not the same. I think I would say that Arkham has better controls, but I just opened the game, so like, so how am I supposed to friggin' know? Kirk Langstrom. Right. I'll call it in on the way to the morgue. All right, Body let's break board. into this place. This is it. Not seeing much police work here. Guess Langstrom kicked it somewhere else. Okay. So scratches. on my end yet you need anything big guy i got this you don't need to do all of this alone if something's weird sounds like you don't trust me nightwing okay so the photo mode is pretty cool he trusted you so so do i we'll finish this for him yeah yeah i get it if I find anything, I'll let you know. Okay. Skin these tracks a bit more. Okay, so they lead into here. Okay, so this is the room that Langstrom died in. He lost a lot of blood. Fast. This game is teen? I'm genuinely surprised this game is an M. Arkham Knight had less blood and it was rated M. Langstrom tried to get to that cabinet. What could be so important? Well, well, a hidden door. You're full of surprises, Dr. Langstrom. A hidden door. This microwave doesn't look right. Maybe it's not just for warming up leftovers. Okay, so we have to look at... Okay, okay. Okay. Maybe I can enter a code on the thermostat. Okay. 
All right, I solved the puzzle myself, and I didn't need the skip to conclusion button that I didn't even notice was there until after I solved the puzzle. Search. Langstrom's desk. Let's see what he's been up to down here. Okay. So we're gonna examine pretty much everything in this room. Alright, so let's head over here. A hard drive. Must be important if it was hidden down here. Better get this back to everyone. I'm done here. I don't think the cops saw the marks on the walls, and they definitely didn't see the hidden lab. I'm bringing you a hard drive I found in there. Can't wait to decrypt that bad boy. See you soon. All right. Now let's head back. Well, this certainly wasn't what I expected to see when I went outside. About the same uh, as Spider-Man PS4, actually. Okay, you can grab them with R2. Now the freaks are here setting fires. Of course. Gangs have been tightening their grip on Gotham since Batman stopped showing up. The freaks want the neighborhood to know they're in control. Well, time for me to crash their party. Charging this place with a... <laughs> Better take care of his buddies before they burn the whole oh, damn place down. Oh, boy. Fire alarm. Die, die, die! Okay, so silent takedowns are still here. That's, nice that's good. And then we still have like ambush takedowns. That was certainly very easy. I don't really know what to call that. That wasn't a predator move. It's old. Smashy, smashy, smash, smash! <laughs> I love cleaning the streets of scum like you. Get back here! Don't wear yourself out or anything! Alright. That was easy. I wonder what here. predator sections are gonna look like in this game. Enjoying the fireworks. Okay, that's how you shoot them up. Dude, I love the attacks in this game. Like, they're so cool. This whole place is gonna burn down. This is almost as broken as uh, the Arkham Knight Red Hood guns. 
Remember those? Oh boy. Oh boy. Alright. So let's get under his sledge here. Alright, let's save these guys. Alright, we're gonna skip this, it's probably not gonna have it. Okay, so we have this guy. Why is this hard for me, bro? This is so easy. I'm, I'm, I'm like, per okay, fine. I kind of find this hard. Kind of. Okay, that that was that was way harder to me than it really should have been. I'm bringing in the hard drive I found so we can crack it open together. Maybe we'll find out what got Langstrom killed. So this is something called the Bat Cycle. So I obviously you see I've seen this in some of the trailers. Woo! Okay, this is cool. So much better than the Batmobile from Night. Dude, that was cool. I don't even care about being, uh... cares about being a nice person who needs that when you have gun it's kind of cool that you can uh that you can uh, shoot it while on the motorcycle all right
Okay. So I'm pretty sure that's the first mission done with. Nice work grabbing that drive from Langstrom's lab. All right. Let's analyze the hard drive. Once we can get at the data, we can figure out what our next move is. I'm going out. I'm not going to sit and wait for whatever this shit is. We're waiting for intel, Jason. Once we have it, then we'll go. <sighs> move. I'm going to solve this case my way. He wanted us to work this together. Whatever. It's making this harder than it has to be, kid. I guess, since we're waiting anyway, we might as well take another look at what Bruce had on Langstrom. Okay, Red Hood seems like... Crap. Seems that like kind of a jerk. <laughs> the primary went out months ago. I thought the backup would hold. I got it. No need. I've put in a small fix that should hold for a while. Oh, that Alfred, man. That does not Wasn't sound sure good. You were coming, Alfred? I don't I'll think... always be here when you need me, Master Richard. When any of you need me. I mean, it sounds okay, I'm glad you're here. but like, I very much prefer the Arkham, uh, Alfred, this place and then I very much work. preferred Michael Caine, whatever the hell his name is, I don't know, Damn over it. that soap, I, I really don't know. Sweet. Looks like my plan wins. And Alfred can't exactly set this place up alone. Indeed, Miss Gordon. I have a list of supplies we'll need. I could do it on my own, but it would be faster if I had help. You can count on us, Alfred. We'll divvy it up. Let's finish what Bruce started. All right! So I think that is first mission done. So, unfortunately, that is time for us to end the video. Uh, this is one of my favorite videos I've ever made. So far, I probably give the game a solid, uh, 8 out of 10 avocados. Uh, the combat gets a solid 9. And everything else would either get a 7 or an 8. So, it gets a solid 8 out of 10 out of avocados. So, uh... I hope you enjoyed, um, would I recommend picking this game up? Yeah, I would. For 80, for the $90, uh, deluxe edition price, probably not. But, but if you're, but the base game, I would recommend purchasing if you have an Xbox Series or a PS5, because it is worth noting that this is a PS5 in this is a current gen exclusive. So, next gen, whatever. A next gen exclusive. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Anyway, if I if I hit 100 subscribers by the end of the year, I'm going to be giving away a $100 uh, Amazon gift card. I've changed it from V-Buck gift card to $100 Amazon gift card. So subscribe if you want if you want an Amazon gift card so I can pay Jeff Bezos money. Anyway, uh, sorry, I, I didn't mean to say Jeff Bezos. I meant to say Lex Luthor. Anyway, subs subscribe or do something. Something, I don't know.